the winner of the men's Royal Rumble match, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Here's the news, here's the headline. I am the guy, and I have been the guy. And I am a three count or a submission away from being the quarterback of the greatest, most prosperous era in the history of sports entertainment. I watched you at the Royal Rumble press conference. You said unequivocally that you were the guy. It doesn't hurt me. You wanna feel how it feels. You wanna know, know that it doesn't hurt me. You wanna at eight hear years old, about the deal. I knew not what I wanted to do, what I needed to do. I was going to win this championship belt right here. I was going to bestow it into the hands of the American Dream, Dusty Rhodes, and I would tell him, nobody can take it away from you now. Unfortunately, that dream died. It died right in front of me. That opportunity passed. Or did it? Let's talk about Cody Rhodes, the man who can't make his own choice, huh? I choose The Rock. It is not your right, it is not your distinction to determine the main event. It is mine! I won the Royal Rumble! I choose you, Roman Reigns. around the world who want you to finish your story. You need to finish your story. You are dealing with the biggest star, the most influential man in the entire entertainment industry. You've got to deal with The Rock. You've got the most powerful champion of the modern era. This is probably the last real chance that any of us has to take that title, to take that power, and to give it to the people. Tonight is the first night that we can say The Rock is a member of the bloodline. You all have bought a side out of The Rock that you haven't seen in years. But you see, this side of The Rock has always been in here. The Rock and Roman Reigns, the biggest WrestleMania main event in the history of WrestleMania. You had it in your hands and you let it go. Cody Rhodes, your story is just ending. Our story is just beginning.